Okay, now we go to the pressure profiling. Yeah, because this machine has a, no, a particular. This machine has a particular feature that the R58 doesn't have. Yeah. In fact, the big difference between the two machines is inside control box and software. Okay. You can set the pressure, the temperature of the of the group, and the temperature of the service boiler from the PID, from the connection port. Yeah. by choosing the degrees, uh, service boiler on, off, uh, the temperature of the, boil of the boiler for the coffee, okay? Then you move on with the P, you choose the temperature for the service, okay? Till here, it's all the same like the R58. Okay. But then there will be another step, which is the profile that was oh. before the language. Just one second. Wait, I go. Yeah. Exactly. No. A. Yeah, exactly. You enter the A. Or enter here. And you set the, the different profile. Yeah. But now this part, I'm going to describe it from the phone. Okay. This is more immediate. Okay. okay. Because this machine has one connection port to speak with in case we don't have the phone. In okay. case you have a phone for Android and iPhone, you can speak let's say with a machine, with an app, the Rocket app. Ah, nice, okay. okay. The Rocket app says, <clears throat> so first oh. of all, to start, because, yeah. okay. you have to connect with the machine. Yeah. Ah, uh. let's turn so. Okay. You have to Also, this we have to improve a little yeah, bit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, better <laughs> yeah. version. Okay, no, no. connection. Yeah, you have to connect with the machine, and then you have all the settings, starting ah. from from machine state. You can choose standby. Yeah, or yeah. The language, of course, English or German. Service boiler. You can choose to be off or on. Water supply, tank, or yeah. hard plumbing. Yeah. Temperature, of course, Celsius or Fahrenheit. Profile, you can choose for three different profiles that we are going to show you in a short while. Go back to the main screen and we go to the brew pressure. Let's start with example with the A. We have five different steps. Okay. Seconds and how many bar do I want in this range of periods? Yeah, okay. Six sec seconds at four bar, 18 seconds at nine bar, six seconds and five bar. And then you close yeah. the extraction and the machine will say to you by the flashing light that the extraction is finished. Okay. So then, this is only example. Yeah, yeah. Exactly, exactly. Then you have the boiler temperature which is the same concept like the R58. Okay. You can set the coffee boiler, let's say here for instance is 105, which is more or less 92 degrees on a group. Yeah. And then service boiler, which is 123, Okay. which is uh, at the moment is 1.2 bar yeah. for the steam. The material of the boiler is stainless steel? Exactly. Both okay. boiler are stainless steel. And the, another thing that we are not yeah. able to see apart from taking out the drip tray, is that all the, the structure of the machine oh. is stainless steel. Cool. So no more steel, stainless steel, all stainless steel. Stainless steel, everything. Wow, super, guy. Okay, now we go to the special function uh, wake up call for exactly, the machine. Exactly, So the last feature in the, in the main screen is uh, the, the function where you can choose uh, at what time the machine should start to work. So important to say that the switch must be on. The machine stays, for instance, in standby for all night. Yeah, yeah. And you can choo choose, for instance, that the machine should start work, meaning that the heating element will yeah. start to work at 7.40. You confirm it. And then you can also say, okay, I'm getting out I'm yeah. leaving home at 8 40, 9 o'clock. Yeah. So please, machine, go back to the standby position. Yeah. 
standby meals uh, boiler are shut off. Exactly. Okay. Exactly. Yeah. At that time, so mm. you can go and the machine stops to work, and only the the light will stay on. Wow. Okay. Amazing. Amazing. Grazie mille. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. R60? Esatto, esatto, okay. R60. Wow.